On this channel, we solve Sudoku puzzles without candidates. Almost every video on this channel is done without pencil marks. This puzzle is a subscriber request. It was sent to me by Dominic. I liked it, so I'm sharing it with all of you. You can print this puzzle and fill it in as you watch. Just click on the link in the description below or go to sudokuprimer.com menu item print YouTube puzzles before you watch. Well, this puzzle isn't the most difficult, but it is kind of tricky. It has its twists and turns, but we're going to use lots of patterns and techniques to solve this puzzle rather easily. Well, let's get solving. First of all, we have a 7 right here because we have 7, 7, 7. That leaves these two, but we've got a 7 here and a 7 here. So these are ghost 7s right there. So that makes that a 7. And then we've got a, a same similar situation here. Got a seven, sevens and eights right here. So these are seven, eight twins right here. And there's a five here, so we have ghost fives there. So we have five, five, five ghost fives. That makes that a five right there. All right, and right off the bat, we have triplets in box five right here, these three cells. We've got a 1, 5, and 7 here, and these are so these are 1, 5, 7 triplets. That makes these 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 3, 4, and 8 right there. Got a 4 and a 4 there, so that's a 4. 8, so that's an 8, and that makes that a 3 right there. All right, we can't solve the 157s yet, but they helped us find these three numbers there. Okay, now we've got a ghost a gate pattern right there with a 3 going through it and a 3 here, so that means one of these is a 3. So we have 3, 3, 3. And with that 3 there, that makes us a 3. All right, and... Uh, once we put this three in here, we have threes here, fours here, so three, four twins right there. And that makes, let's see what else we've got missing here. We know three of these three fours now. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, nine, eight, nine, two, six, and nine. We've got a two there and a two there, so that means that's a two right there. And uh, remember, we have these seven, eight twins right there. We'll use those again in a minute. All right, now let's look at uh, this row right here. We've got a, let's see, we're missing two, four, five, eight. Two, four, five, and eight. And here we'd have a two, four, and an eight, so that makes that a five. And uh, got a 2 here and a 2 here, so these can't be a 2. So that makes that a 2. And we've got 4 and 8 left over right there, 4, 8 twins. All right, now that we've filled in these two numbers here, and we know these are 7 and 8, we know these are 6, 9 twins right there. Okay, 6, six 9, 7, 8. And uh, <clears throat> with that, let's see, we got a four and eight there, and a two there, okay, and then we've got um, twos there, we got a two there and a two there, so that makes that a two right there. 
to 2, that makes that a 2. 2, 2 there, so that makes that a 2. 2, 2, and 2, that makes that a 2. And 2, 2, 2, 2, that makes that a 2. I think that now we've got all our 2s. Okay, so now we've fin finished all our twos. Okay, and then we've got um, we've got a plus pattern right here in uh, box four with a one and a three going through the middle of it this way vertically. So these are one three twins right here. One of these being a one makes that a one right there. And that a one right there. Once we filled that one in, that can't be a one anymore. All right. And then we've got five and seven there missing. And there's a seven there, so we can fill those in. That leaves that with a, a six there. All right, and then um, these are one and three that we found a couple minutes ago with this plus pattern. With this one here, neither of these can be a one, so that's a one right there. And we're left with three and eight right there. And we can fill in this three right here too right there. So what are we missing here? Five, seven, five and seven. And there's a seven there, so we can fill those in. And now we've got a five, seven here, five, seven there. So these are five sevens right there. So three, eight, five and seven, that makes that a four right there. All right, and now we've got uh, six and nine missing in this column right here. But these are four and eight, the only two numbers left in this row. And notice this right here. We've got, um, let's see what this could be. It can be a one, two, three, five, six, seven. Um, <clears throat> Can't be an eight because these are four eight twins. Nine. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So three or nine. And what's this right here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So these are three nine twins right there. So that makes these five six twins right there. And we got a five and a five there, so that's got to be the five right there, and that's the six. And those fives and a five there make this a five. And remember, these are five sevens, so we can put in the seven there. And uh, so these are three and nine. We've got three and eight there, three nine twins, three eight twins, four eight twins. Seven, eight, six, nine. So with that six, we can fill in the six nines here. That makes that a six. Remember these three, four twins here. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And a nine goes here, the only number left in that box. And we've got a one right there. Okay. And uh, with these three and eight right here, well, um, that seven will help us solve these. So that's seven and eight. And these were three and eight. With that eight, we can fill those in. And with this three, we can do the three nines here. All right, now we're missing eight and nine here. Six and nine there. 
Let's see. Oh, we got a nine right there. We can put in. And so we can put a nine here and an eight there. And then we have a nine here and six there. So we have the eight nines there, six nines there. This is three and four. All right, now this is, this is one, four, and six right here. One, four, six, seven, eight, nine. So there's a one and a six, so that's a four. All right, so now with that four, we can solve the three fours there. And we're only missing an eight in this row. And now we've got a three here, three here, three there. So that's a three. And with that eight, we can solve the four eights right here that we found earlier. And now we've got, uh, let's see, one and four missing here. There's a four there, so we can put a four there and a one there. And now we've got a six missing here, the only number left in this box. And then a one and a six there. And that's it. All right. Well, if you look at this puzzle um, and don't notice a lot of these patterns and techniques that I mentioned as we're solving it, it's a fairly tricky puzzle, not the most difficult, but it's fairly tricky. But as I was solving it, I started seeing all kinds of techniques I could use and uh, twins and triplets and, and things that helped me along. So it made it rather easy. So, well, anyway, uh, there you have it. Thank you, Dominic, for the, for the puzzle, for sending me this puzzle. And I hope that helped you um, understand how to solve this better. Well, thank you, thank you everybody for watching, and I'll see you on the next video.